All right, guys, welcome back. This is Killer Panda, and I'm back from a little little break. I took a little break for a little bit, but now I'm back, and we're playing the Spatials. Spatials is pretty cool. It's kind of like a, uh, it's like Star Trek Deep Space Nine, except it's on a planet, and, you know, like Dwarf Fortress meets Star Trek meets something meets adorable little characters so should be pretty good this just came out on steam uh i think I, I think it came out just just this week so pretty new um i know it's been on desura for a little bit but yeah um what's uh this is by weird and rye games and i know they're coming out with something else new pretty soon which maybe i'll try to get my hands on it sounded kind of cool but uh yeah let's get into it Boom. I've only played this a little bit. Oh, 5781 AD, Human Federation Headquarters, Earth. Greetings, officer. Your outstanding work as a rank 5 bureaucrat has been noticed by your superiors. You have been chosen to build and lead a new station in an uncharted corner of the galaxy. Okay. Explore the surrounding systems and their planets. Discover their resources and deal with any opposition. You have the trust of the Human Federation. Cool. All right. So yeah, they've got little tutorials and everything. I'm just going to run through real quick and just turn off all the tutorials because they kind of, they kind of get in the way. But, um, yeah, so this is, this is basically, this is the game. You know, you can, uh, it's, it's really, it's kind of reminisce, reminiscent to me of like, you know, uh, kind of, of. I want to say like you know it's it's really similar to Dwarf Fortress with with all the uh you know kind of how you build and everything everything's square based you know everything's little squares um all the uh all the really important stuff that you do is it, it kind of um what am I thinking it's yeah it reminds me of Dwarf Fortress in the sense that it really makes me think of when you're building digging into the mountains and everything it's like you almost kind of have to you know you have to build these little corridors to make each room and then you you kind of build out from there and all of that stuff so yeah but um so yeah you had you say you got these little guys i got baldwin eve lou otis and patty and this is my group um and we're gonna they're they're both in charge of completely building everything and they're also in charge of going on missions. So you can kind of as you go along you can you can hire on more guys so that maybe you've got some people around who can always do this construction and maintenance and building stuff and then you can have other guys who actually go out on missions and you know you know seek out strange new life and new civilization new civilizations but um, at the start, it's kind of, you don't, you want to have everybody, but you also want to have enough, uh, you also want to make progress on your little, on your little colony because you, yeah, people will come and visit. It's, it's just, it's tons of fun. Okay. And that's all you need to know. It's tons of fun and it's great. What's with all the questions? Um, starting off the game it's a it's a little bit uh there's there's a little bit of a of a challenge at the very beginning just uh just kind of trying to figure out exactly what you're supposed to do the first time i i they have these little these missions that you can basically have your guys run in the background and first i was sending all my guys on these missions because i thought that was what i was supposed to do but it turns out you can actually you can go in and you can look at the planets and you can actually choose a mission and you actually send your little way party and control them. So after I figured that out, I was like, oh, and you know, I was I was all excited to send my guys out on missions. And then wouldn't you know it, they're all, you know, they're all busy with the missions I already gave them, so they can't do anything. So it's kind of a little a little bit of a learning curve. I think uh it's the kind of game that you'd normally have a wiki for, and you just kind of figure it out that way. But alas, I didn't. I, I have not found one at this point, so that's how things are. Uh, we're going to... So, you yeah, you put furniture into a specific room. Without having the right room, you can't put the furniture down. 
So you have to build the room and then you can build the furniture in there. This thing, the build recy the recycler is just for, uh, I think you just take cheap stuff and turn it into better stuff. These things give you extra, the pallets give you extra storage room down here, which is really easy to fill up. Um, it might be that, uh, last, the, the first time I played through it, um, I think I also, I wasn't using the recycler enough. So you'll get a lot of random stuff that's kind of useless. And I think you're supposed to recycle it, but I wasn't doing that. So I was like, why? Well, I don't have any space, but yeah. In a minute, we'll get our little, little, little space, little spaceport built. And I'll just pop that right. Meh. That looks good. And then I will, uh, and then we can, uh, we can start digging into, oh, tech tree. We'll also learn how to make a factory. Yeah. Cause that'll let us make workshops, smelters, a kitchen, use kitchens to make food. And then you can make a, like a little restaurant. And then when people come to your colony, they can eat Then you can use the metal, the metal press to make repair parts. And once you make the repair parts, then you can sell the repair parts to, you know, passersby. So that's kind of cool. Um, yeah. All right. So we're going to unlock that and I do not have enough science to unlock anything else. So we'll just let that, we'll let that be where it is. See, now there's these little guys and they're all very unhappy because there's nothing to do in this terrible place. They're like, this place sucks and you suck for building it. You suck, you suck, you suck. And I'm like, why are you so mean guys? And they're like, shut up. But, uh, so now, yeah, so now we've got a little, little base set up. Um, we can go through all our people, but they're all terrible at everything. So, no skin off my nose. We're going on a mission. They do also have resources here. Lots of slime and bugs. That's what I like to see. Slime and bugs. This is our little away team. Start. Send them down to the planet. An archaeologist has found something interesting in the surface of this planet and needs our help to finish their research. Oh, well, wonderful. You can kill things. Oh. Come on, he's not out of range. Pew! Deal with it. Who's out of range now? Out of my face is more like it. Hey! Die. That's what you get. That's what happens when you cross me. You die. Officers, we're on the brink of an amazing discovery. This very ancient artifact resonates with some nearby fragments. Find them and bring them to me. Let's go! Hey. What's your problem, homie? Die. How about you die? Hey, you die too. I don't know if he was actually after me or not, but I get scared. I get nervous. Nervous that everyone's gonna die. Hey. Get out of here. Set phasers to death. Pow. Did we find the fragments yet? No, not yet. I am so... What? What? What am I supposed to... I've, I've not dealt with... Oh, that's what the fragments look like. Okay. Don't attack me, you jerks. Hey, what did I just say? Grenades. Boom, rocket launcher, something. Everybody's paying the price. That's what you get. You die too. Oh, miss. Whatever. I'm not even worried about it. Boom! Unstoppable. Pew! Yeah. So needless to say, I am pretty good at this. As you can tell, I'm just shooting everything. Granted, these things can't really fight back. But they're learning a valuable lesson today. Um, where's the last, where's the last artifact? Uh, it's, jeez, it's so far away. And these guys don't walk very fast. Aliens. Aliens. Enjoy dying. Yeah. Like a machine, like a ninja, no. We did it. We did it, give us lots of money. Silence! I am making history here. Oh, they pro they fit perfectly. Yes, this is pure perfection. How powerful. I feel it. It's in me. The power is mine. Ready your blasters. 
Oh my god, he's an alien. He's a he's a he's a horrible alien. Launch launch things at him. Hit him with things. Okay. Oh, so now we can build a monolith? That doesn't seem very useful. Oh. The space station is just completely abandoned. Everybody just skipped at, just skipped town. Bye planet. Okay. So cool. So we unlocked a new system. We yeah. So that's that's basically that's that's the rundown of how you get stuff done. You also um you also get more Let's make a make a restaurant. Not enough not enough research points. Psych, let's not make a restaurant. Um so that's how that's how you basically that's how you progress in the game. You go to other planets to get more technology. Use the technology to uh build more stuff. And you also get more little bits of things. I know we use the slime to make ice cream. I don't know what the bugs are for. Hopefully not for ice cream. Eh, yeah. Uh, yeah, let's, let's go to the next. Oh, also, another cool thing that you can do. So once we go back to that planet that we went to, Dachshund, we can actually now... Um, buy resources from them. Well, we're like we're assigning. Yeah, we're we're buying exploitation rights of it, so we're exploiting it. I'll take bugs and slime. Yeah, bugs and slime. That's what we're getting from them now. So that's that's how you do it. And then you can we can go to this this Gaia planet, and we'll get a research point for that. We'll get fruits, and then we can exploit their fruits and oil. So let's let's go on a mission. Yep, yeah, spawn a boss, complete objectives, destroy factories, blow up trees. Got it. Can do. Yeah, yeah, die all of you. Die all of you. You'll all pay. You'll all learn not to cross me. Asha! Blammo! They look like little predators. I don't know what the yellow guy does. It's some sort of power up, but I don't actually understand it at all. Uh, I really need to kill this guy. We can take a lot of hits, though, fortunately. Just keep shooting everything. We did it. We destroyed the factories. Now we gotta do go destroy some different factories. Shazam! Do we need to destroy these innocent people? I think so. Yeah. I think these... I think they're cruising for a bruising, you know? Um... Let's, uh, let's shoot that guy. He's tough. He's a hardy little mofo. Let's blow up some of those things. Shoot this guy again. It's really hard to see what's going on with all these trees. With all this tree business going on. Eh. Or did we kill everybody? Not even close. I can't even see. How am I supposed to know if I killed everyone or not? Hey, die. The both of you. And you too. I'm tired of all the business. I'm tired of the attitude. You know? I'm tired of this guy. Really tired of this guy. Look at him. He's just staring at me. Is he even doing anything? Blam. Shoot him. All power to the engines. Boom. I thought I've been eliminating pirates this whole time. How many pirates must die? You know? Hey. Keep your attitude under in, under in, in check. Under check. Under control. Alright, let's blow up some pirates. We really need to stop getting so hurt. Oh, let's uh, 
Let's do that. Cool. All right. Dead. Everybody's getting shot and hurt and dying. I don't care much for this. Why is he staying so far away? Is he like... He's kind of a Boba Fett character. Well, we killed we killed tiny adorable Boba Fett. I hope we're happy with ourselves. Yeah. Yeah, we did it. Okay. So, let's go leave the planet. Leave. Okay. Uh, there's Tato. As a rank 3 Federation greeter, I am bound by the friendly exhortation pact of 5381 to greet you. Please consider yourself greeted. My demand to consider yourself pleased by my greeting shall not be interpreted as a, as a condescending remark, a war declara declaration, or an innuendo reference to any possible bodily process. That's funny. There's some good writing in this. I'm, I'm, I'm in favor of it. I'm going to hire a couple guys. Because the worst thing that can happen is everybody's on an away mission, and while they're all... While they're all out doing stuff. Is that better than what I have? I don't know. I don't I don't know how to read this gear. There's a lot of Alright, so these guys are my away team. Level one ray gun. That's the best, I think. Level one grenade. Okay. I think you're fine, Baldwin. You're gonna get a laser. Alright. Oh, so there are better ones. That seems like a lot to spend just to improve that a little bit, though, right? Like, you could throw out the old one. Which I don't really want to do that. Patty. Enjoy the phaser, Patty. That's a pretty good health boost, though. Cool. Um, sweet. 83 power. The one. A good strategist knows that if she had to pick only one weapon, it would be this rifle. This is the one. Taking it. Cool. So, what is that? Oh, I should... I, I need to I need to run through the rest. Okay, so you have a little explodey. Okay, we'll do that. I guess you're kind of just expected to... Kind of just do... Improve everything you possibly can. But it seems kind of wasteful. You know, because you do have to destroy your old stuff. Recharge the most depleted officer with a large amount of energy. Sure. I don't see why not. It's got a it's got a little star next to it, so you know it's good. Okay, now we have enough technology. We can make a dining hall. And this will start making us cash money from all these suckers who keep coming into town. So that'll be nice. Gonna build right there, and then we shall, we shall craft the dining room. And we will also, what else do we need? We need a corridor from the kitchen to the dining room. Everybody's gonna be real impressed by my dope dining room, or by, um, restaurant, or whatever. You know, um, kitchen, 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 kitchen. Make a food create, food creatorium. Yeah, this is where food is created. Gonna make, yeah, we're gonna make a, a number of those. That way we can really, we can start making ice cream and get out of my way, guys. I'm trying to make rations. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. You make juice. You make dessert. And this one is the executive in charge of pizza. Captain Pizza. We've got so much slime, we've got seeds and fruit and all sorts of things. Um, where was the place I just went to? Antiono. So let's uh we'll take some we'll take some fruit, we'll take some oil. We've already got slime, let's get some water. Let's get some seeds. Yeah. Yeah. And then once that's built, we have so much money. Not enough resources, everything's out. Everybody is out of everything. Cha-ching. And cha-ching. Make those. We'll make these little booths. Look at that. Isn't that, isn't that nice? 
Yeah, that looks... That's looking good. Oh, man. Everybody's going to be so happy. Everybody's going to be like, Oh, this is such a nice little place to have dinner. Yeah. Yeah, now we're making money off all these suckers. Fools. Just because they have to eat. <laughs>